we can call this segment In Bed with Doug because I'm in bed. I just wanted to announce a quick PSA, I believe they call it. Um, we're getting ready for a big gender reveal party and I still don't get the excitement around a gender reveal. I don't get why there needs to be a party, why there needs to be ridiculous names. Um, but what I realized was there are so many arguments that can be thwarted. I'm not sure if that's even a word, but um, can be avoided by just saying okay to ridiculous things. Rule number one. The name of the gender reveal party is going to be ties and tutus. When asked if you like the name or what name would you suggest, do not recommend, I don't care what the name is. I can't think of anything. Second most important rule, if you're asked to paint a cardboard box for a ties and tutu gender reveal party, do not say it's just cardboard and it's going to be thrown away afterwards. Wrong answer. If you say that, apparently it means that you don't care about this baby. That box represents our baby and I care about our baby. And that box is going to get painted just like I would paint a baby. And you paint a baby with care. Because paint doesn't work well with carpet. We must cover the carpet. Otherwise my roommates would get really, really upset. And my roommates do have the ability to ground me, unfortunately, until we get our own house. First rule in painting, find the surface that you're gonna paint. I can't find the paint right, right now, though. Um, this is what the cardboard box sees when you go to paint it. Um, bu -bu -bu. You can tell I'm just stalling until I find paint. Some people are born gifted. I was gifted with being able to paint boxes. Just, it's a gift and a curse, I don't know. I'm gonna find paint because it's getting really dumb. All right. I am getting married and I'm terrified because it's a stranger. It's <laughs> crazy. It's very real. Hey. I can't do it, I can't do it. Let's do this. 